So hello guys, we're gonna customize the bongo cat. If you haven't have, the, if you don't have the bongo cat yet, go to my link. There's the link. If you cannot press it, uh, just type it over and it will work. Well, go to here with the X. You can see what is on your screen. Now there is just a pad and just a different uh, key input. So we're gonna change them. You gotta change this to true. But you can get the mouse as well though, uh, without the mouse, so just the pad, if you want that. I'm gonna change these to the desired letters you want. And the W and S. Don't change anything else, quit it, save it, and you're here. And now what you gotta do is, uh, you gotta edit this one. Mouse BG uh, uh, point PNG. This is the one you gotta change. Close this. You gotta have GIMP, it's a easy, it's a, it's a foot. Fucking hell, it doesn't fucking. Fuck you! God damn it. So we're here. You gotta use GIMP, it's free. And we're gonna use it. It's If you start it up, it's not gonna be like how I have it, but you, you can see what I do. So yeah, it's not that hard. So what you gotta do is get this mouse BG uh, point PNG, drag it over here. Then we can close this. Well, full skill this. Fancer it. Um, I'm gonna open my uh, my toolbox where I have all the things. Well, first of all, let's get this out. What you guys do is press the loop one, go like this, and then click on it, delete. You see the selected area, go to select and say nothing. So that goes away. You see the other marks now away. So what you gotta do right now is not that hard. We gotta go get a background. So let's get one. So we say uh, images. Let's find a good one. If you want mine, what I use is, let me see if I can find it. This one is the one I chose. So if you want to go choose, choose that one. Copy it. And then you paste it in here. Let's look at, let's get this do. And then here new layer. It's a green button that says new layer. Make a new layer. We're gonna do that. Go to the integrated transformation. This is really big, so let's change it up a little bit. Let's see how this looks. Get this one on top. It doesn't look good. Does it? No, it doesn't. So let's go like that. Let's get a little bit bigger. You can see now the TV on the background. We've done that. And now we gotta get a... Let's go for the hair. Uh, the hair. Let's go for the uh, for his eyebrows so you can do whatever you want let's just go for this I did it I did it like this and yeah just tap the pencil and draw whatever you want on it I did this because you know Super Saiyan God and all so what you gotta do next is let's go for the chair this one Type it exactly like this, and you might maybe find it. I don't know for sure, but this one I use. If you find something similar like this, go use it. Copy it. it doesn't it, it? doesn't matter if it's white on the background. You're gonna see what I do with it. So we gotta paste it in and make a new layer like uh, before. So we gotta make it a little bigger. Get that transform button. Make it a little bit bigger. Let's see, transform. Let's first, you know, get this out of here. 
delete. You s you see what I did there? You uh, press the uh, magic wand. Press. Uh, be sure you're on the uh, the right uh, layer. Then press the white space and then delete. That's as simple as that. The background's now gone. Go to select and say nothing to get that selective shit g gone. You see, there's still whites, but we'll, we'll, sh we'll uh, take care of that in a minute when we got the uh, real size of the, of the, the uh, chair. Transform. This one has to be on top. You see, it's, it's kind of good like that. So what we do next is just the gaming chair, uh, gaming, uh, gaming chair, the hair, we get the Super Saiyan hair. Let's go, let's go for a normal Super Saiyan this time. What I used the uh, last time was this, this, and then the the black one, uh, the, uh, the white one. It was a little bit better to do the white one. Because if you got the blocks one, it's, it's a little di difficult to get the blocks away, so. So we go here, say copy, go back here and print it with control V, make a new layer out of it and do that over here, get this, what we're first gonna do is get this black around it away with the magic wand. What you do next is choose the hair you want. Oh, I actually see now oh, that's that has to be like that. Okay, but um, we gotta go get the other hairs away. So what we do is draw a line, and then delete. It. Wait one second, it doesn't work. Why? Because. Every, every time when you delete it, it's still selected, so go to select and say nothing. What you gotta do now is get the loss again, and just get all the hairs away. Make something like that, and then delete. So we don't have that. Go to select, nothing, do the same with the uh, Super Saiyan here. Delete. Select, nothing. So we just have the Dragon Ball God here you want it so let's go to transform make it go a little bit like this a little bit like this and a little bit like that we gotta I used the wrong ones So you gotta do it like that. Just play a little bit it, but a little bit with it. I think this is the good, good one. So you gotta get it like a little bit. Uh, that it fits good on his head. Like that. And then you say transform. And now you got that Super Saiyan hair on his fucking head. And now you can add your logo and all. I just the text. Made it like that. Made it red. And then set Doku. Then I went here, say text, I don't know what the fuck happened, just, oh yeah, wait, I think I, oh fuck, I fucked it up, say text, go here, make text field, make a red, and write on it, so this is obviously too big, so let's go like this. And then select it and get that down. 
I got it down like right there. That was good for me. So we gotta make it smaller right now. The box. So what we're gonna do now is select this just. I put it there and I put my own YouTube logo over there. But yeah, we don't have to do that. Oh, how to get this uh, desk black is obviously easy. Go to the mouse background, select the magic wand again, select the white area, say delete. Don't say delete. That will make it transparent. But go here, right click, edit, and then fill with foreground color. This has to be the one of the colors you want. By the way, if you want black, this is the foreground. This is the background color. So what we're gonna do next, if you want it completely black, go grab the loss and go like that. I'm gonna make it completely black, you know? You can make it any color you want. Go to select, go nothing. And then do it again over here. Because this, these are the places where it's still, uh, you know, a little bit white. So make it a little bit better looking. Say select, nothing. And now you're done. You want this on your uh, thing. So all you gotta do is now to file and overwrite it. But if it doesn't work, like me, okay, it doesn't. Gonna, I don't think it's gonna work on me. It doesn't, I don't know why. So what you do is go here, go to file, and then export as mouse, just don't change anything. Go to your desktop, export it there, say replace, and then export. And now we got it over here. You see? So we go here. We draw this one in here. And you say okay. And it changed now. As you can see the time. It changed. If we press it we see this. So you can also change the right hand and the left hand. But it's not like really necessary. You can just put a logo on it like we did. Uh, it's not that hard. So what you gotta do next is go to OBS. We gotta uh, add another one. We gotta add game capture. Say whatever you want. Say Oompa Loompa. And then we gotta change the, uh, this one. But this one's already uh, did. Wait one second. Let's just add uh, another one. So go to uh, game capture, put a new one. Let's just name game capture for this one. Say uh, specific fenster, and you gotta open it now. So go here, open your Mongo Cat X. As you can see, it's fully changed, which is awesome. So you gotta open. Let this one uh, open. You come over here. You say this. And you see, mm, you don't see it. You gotta annihilate it. Uh, go to this, and now you can see it. Uh, Bongo cat point X. Go set that on OK, and do it. I'm gonna freeze this one. So, if it's OK, it has to be in and now. Uh, yeah, you see, we got it over here. And now you can record or uh, start your stream, you know. So yeah, that, that was the video. I hope you liked it, Bongo Cat. But yeah, if you like this, you know, subscribe to my channel, my YouTube channel. It's on TikTok as well. Um, and you know, follow me on TikTok as well. So yeah, ciao.